What is going on guys, Overture here with the new episode of Titanfall Overview, a series where I look at the weapons of Titanfall, give their specifications, and my favorite playstyle with the weapon. Now, this video we're going to be covering is a weapon that I sort of have mixed feelings about. Um, I don't know if it's the semi-automatic nature of the weapon or the game in general that makes me feel this way, but the weapon we're going to be covering in this video is the G2A4 rifle. And the description for this weapon is, in spite of recent advances in weapons technology, the older G2A4 semi-automatic rifle remains a favorite of special forces units due to its high damage and extremely precise fire, a testament to its high level of craftsmanship. And... After reading this, I just want to say that it's it's a good weapon. You can use it for the way it's supposed to. It's a long-range gun with really high damage and really high accuracy. But in my hands... Now, this is where it, it really gets confusing to me. Because I'm not the best user of semi-automatic weapons. I don't know if it's the fire rate or the accuracy uh, that I have. But I just I can't balance... Uh, firing the trigger rapidly while maintaining good accuracy and uh, or I can't I'll be really accurate and I won't be able to fire as many shots in a row as fast as other people could so anyways the only problem I seem to really have with this weapon is I think it needs a little bit of a damage boost I think it should be able to kill people in four shots it takes about five or six in order to take a pilot down and I think that's a little bit too much especially since they're using a high fire rate weapon opposed to yours and the other reason is in this game a lot of people tend to be more mobile so it's harder to actually get your semi-automatic shots to hit them you have to sort of lead your target you have to hit where they're going so i believe if they hire the damage just a little bit it might make it a more formidable weapon against the r101c carbine but anyways guys uh, after playing around with the weapon for a little bit the play style that i most like to use with this weapon is first off you're are going to need uh, a different sight and in my opinion the iron sights with the weapon are okay but if you use the dot to manage where you're going to shoot your enemy sometimes I miss when I'm aiming my dot at a person I pull the trigger it doesn't actually show a hit marker like I don't hit them and if I use the HCOG or the hollow sight I find that most of my shots actually hit on target so I, I recommend using one of those and as for the mods actually you could basically run whatever you want it, it's just basically your preference they all have a sort of pros and cons the only thing about the suppressor is I know if you are planning on hunting other grunts and stuff plus you're going to be firing off a lot of shots you're going to show up the radar often suppressor might seem like a good decision but the damage drop off in my opinion isn't worth it especially since it takes more shots to kill them uh, the match trigger, again, it's, it's, I'm not very good at rapid firing a semi-automatic weapon, so if you want to be the more running gunner, you want to not be on the long sights, you can use the match trigger, but in my opinion, I think the extended magazine is the better of the three mods, because I shoot a lot, and I miss a lot, so having more, uh, capacity in my magazine definitely helps me keep my shots on target. Now, the playstyle, again, I sort of mix it up a little bit. I mix between running and gunning in the long range. I like to stay towards the medium range fights, but I like to keep running. I like to, after I kill someone, I'm automatically moving around because if I'm not using suppressor, I show up on the radar. So I want to make sure that I keep my surroundings different every time I'm able to see where enemies are on the map and just sort of go to where they are and hunt them down. This is... This is the perfect weapon if you like to perch on the roof and just shoot at people that are running by or just anticipating where enemies are going to be. But anyways, guys, that's going to be it for this weapon. Let me know what you guys think. What do you like running on this gun? I'm really interested in hearing what you guys have to say because, like I said, I'm not very good with semi-automatic weapons. So if you have a better setup for me to learn and use this weapon more efficiently, I would like to hear it. But anyways, guys, it's been Overture Soul. Thank you guys for checking out this video. I have another video up there. I think you guys should check out if you haven't seen it before it's my new show i created called the soul show where i find cool links and little news bits on the internet and i kind of share it with you guys i highly suggest you guys go check it out but anyways this has been over to soul please like subscribe all that good stuff but most importantly guys have a great day